Are you ready to stop the self-sabotage and create the life you desire? Well, in order for that to happen, you need to break free from the bad beliefs that are holding your success hostage. You need to optimize the stress by turning it into extra energy for success. And those hurtful habits? Well, we need to give that pain a purpose for progress. Welcome to Stop the Self-Sabotage and Create the Life You Desire podcast. What's one of the worst things that you can do if you find a snarling dog running at you? Uh, You were, let's say, outside walking on a beautiful day and all of a sudden this beast shows up and it's acting like it wants to take a bite out of you. What's one of the worst things that you can do? Run from it. Because if you run from it, it's going to chase you. And chances are it's faster than you. Now, what does this have to do with my big idea for you for the month of May, where we're going to turn stress that you have in in your life right now into extra energy for your success? What, what, What does this have to do with that? It's simple. You're running away from something. All of us are. It's called the human condition right now. Everything we've gone through over the last year and some odd weeks has us wanting to get back into life, but not getting into life to reveal who we are at our healthiest. Getting back into life, we have a second chance, and we're wanting to get back into life to get away from what we've just experienced this past year and now we got a problem with that because our powerful mind is conditioned that when we try to move away from something when we run away from it then we need to have something chasing us and then we wind up dealing with what's known as safe problems Safe problems are distractions to what the real roadblock is. And the real roadblock is that we don't want to necessarily give our pain a purpose for progress. We're past that right now. Our real roadblock is we need to move into life and and take advantage of the second chance, deciding on what we're going to reveal about us at our very best. It's not getting away from the pain. It is who are we really? And let's peel off the layers of the fear and uh, the being unhealthy and, and learning how to cope and maladapt because it was the only thing we could do with what was going on, but it will no longer serve us in moving forward. So the big idea is you can turn stress into extra energy for success. But let's use you stress instead of distress. Oh, what's the difference? Mm -hmm. Because the mind experiences these two types of stress. Distress is everything that we do not want in life. But that will never be energy that can be clean enough to move us forward fast. Instead, we want to use you stress, and that is the word EU, and then stress. You stress is when we're challenged to be our very best. It's when we go into a workout and we decide that we can go a little bit further a little bit longer. It's, uh, you know, I I walk with one of my friends every weekend and we pick trails on purpose that are up and down and then up and down again. And that this past weekend, both she and I were wanting to stop and it was like, no, we got to go a little bit further. It's when that relationship begins to break down and you want to go into distress, but instead you're like, no, I need to take responsibility for my portion in this. And then I'm asking them to take responsibility for who they are. And then what if the relationship is important enough, we're going to go out and we're going to get assistance 
and turning on its magnificence. Okay, so May's big idea is turning stress into extra energy for success. So what I'm going to be working with you on, because that's my big pro- promise, is that we're going to reveal the real you for progress. But you've got to start looking at what are your strengths, what are your talents, and what are your abilities that you want to turn on this month? What do you want to move towards, not away from? So until we get together again in your next five to thrive, five minutes to help you to achieve greater heights of success with less effort, focus on what's phenomenal about you so we can begin to use that as our challenge.